cutie. I'm Cindy. Want to be my boyfriend? Ah. Uh, I don't know, Cindy. I can't really see if you got the crazy eyes or not, and I don't know if you have any baggage with you. Do you have baggage? Do you have, like, a, a bad relationship with your dad or your mom? Long lost brother? Alcohol addiction? Sure, why not? <laughs> That's what I like to hear. We'll totally be the cutest couple in school, but first, you have to do something for me. All, always the case. You know, you, you tell a girl you'll be her boyfriend and immediately she wants you to do something for her. Come on, Cindy! What, what if I want you to do something for me? This, this relationship has to be a two-way thing. What, isn't our love enough? <laughs> That's precious. But no, it isn't. You're gonna have to prove it to me. How do I do that? You see that girl over there? That's Lily. She is by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you will ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. No! Fuck you, Cindy! No way! Fine, but don't come crying to me when you die old and alone. I'm like... I'm like three, four years old in this game. Jesus Christ! Good morning, children! It's time for you to pick your buddies. For morning time, or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you can be. Is this really the education system that's going on? Is that a fucking sword? Go find a partner. Okay. What if I want the sword to be my partner? Don't go snooping around in other people's cubbies. <gasps> Ooh. That's their cubbies. What's in my cubby? There's fucking nothing in my cubby. Okay, let's see if I can actually do this gum hair thing. Oh no. That's so mean. Cindy put you up to this, didn't she? I don't even care. Leave me alone. Oh, I feel horrible now. I did what you asked, you fucking heartless monster. Oh my gosh, you totally did. Wow, what happened? What did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She cried. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy, which also makes you my boyfriend. As my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. I'll meet you over by the dollhouse. Do I really want to? Lily had it all. Lily had a little flower in her hair and everything. She could cute little bangs. She lost her brother. You turned me into a monster, Cindy. All I want to do is be fucking happy. Okay. Welcome, home husband. I hope work wasn't too hard, because you're going to be making dinner tonight. Me uh, starts to think that Cindy is a bit high maintenance. Also, possibly slight hint of bitch. But she's a child, so I can't really say that. Why do I have to make dinner? Because I've been so busy maintaining the house and I... Have you been drinking again? What is this game? No, honey, I'm just tired. That's the smell of tired on me. <laughs> oh, sure you are. You're always so tired. I'm sure you won't mind blowing into this then. Is that a breathalyzer? <laughs> you bet it is. And if you blow so much as 0.01, I'm calling your sponsor. Hey, I'm Irish. There's always a slight trace of alcohol in my blood system. I'll take the test. Good. Blow. 0.32? You're trashed right now. How could you do this to me? You said you would get sober. How could you be a father when you can't even take care of yourself? Now I have kids. What is this? I, well, while you were in prison, it, it's probably not yours. I'm sorry. I guess I have my own set of problems to deal with. I woke up today, a bouncing baby boy, ready to start my kindergarten day. Started talking to people, met a friend, he gave me a nugget. Then I met this girl, and my life has spiraled downwards since then. You cheated on me? It was only one time. I was alone. He was there for me when you weren't. I didn't know how to get by. Please don't get mad. We can get through this. Though, I, I still love you. <laughs> I want a divorce. <laughs> I... You're right. This isn't working out. What do we do now? Go spend the night with your mother. <laughs> I guess that's fair. I call you tomorrow. I hope we can sort this out amicably. Wow, that was the most fun I've had playing house in a while. They're gonna make a splendid boyfriend. I want you to have lunch with me. <laughs> oh yeah, we were only playing house. Christ almighty. Oh hey boyfriend. Saved you a spot. Go get something to eat and come sit with me. Yes, dear. 
are you doing there, Shunny? You want some tasty nutritious slop for lunch? Yes, dear. I mean, yes! Damn, I've been conditioned. <laughs> I have slop. Eat slop. Oh, good. I was just thinking about... Oh, darn it. My stupid mother packed me something that's not vegan. She knows I'm all vegan right now. God, that woman is insufferable. Hey, uh, sweetie poosh, knock him up. Uh, would you be a darling and go get me something vegan? Something vegan? Yeah, you know, um, like... I don't know exactly what it means, but I know it's good. So just go ask around and see if you can find something vegan. Monty, my boy! I wanna buy something. A salad? Looking to cut some fat from your diet? Would you fucking judge me? I'll do what I want! I'm slim and I know it and I'm happy about it. Okay? What did you get me? Here's a salad. Ugh! A salad? Oh! Now that I think about it, I guess that would be vegan, huh? Gross. Why do I have to do this myself? Where's Jeeves, our butler? He, he usually does everything for me. I don't know. You're being so good to me today. You're probably the most well-trained boy I've ever met. I should use you for something at recess. Hmm. I have an idea. What? I'm really liking the way the Willy wear- Lily- Willy- Lily Willy? Where's that gum? Maybe we could put something else in there. What do you mean? Jerome is telling me about when, how the janitor has all sorts of gross stuff in his closet. I'm thinking we find something and give it to Lily. Doesn't he keep that locked? Oh, you don't have to worry about that. Look what I have. You have the key. Yep. A girl has her ways. I'm just almost over, so listen for the bell while you're in there. The janitor will come back shortly after it rings, so get there as soon as possible. Let's do this! Mwah. Bye, sweetie. Which one's the janitor's cousin? The dirty, moldy, skanky looking one? Unlock the door. Yes. Oh, sweet Jesus. Does he have a fucking body in here? It's a bucket that's catching the blood from that thing on the table. This would be a truly vile thing to dump on someone's head. Oh, God. Am I gonna dump a bucket of blood on Lily's head? God, I'm fucking recreating Carrie all over again. Cindy, a bitch! I'm just gonna say it out right now. I often call someone legitimately a bitch, but Cindy, a bitch. Well, what did you get? This bucket filled with blood. Oh my god, it's perfect. You're the best. Come up here and I'll call her over. I'm gonna get in position. Oh boy. Here I go, ready to pour some blood on the poor innocent girl's head. Hey, Lily. Lily, sweetheart, come over here. I want to show you something. Why can't you just leave me alone, Cindy? I'm so sick of you harassing me. I'm not going to harass you. We can be friends. Just come over here. Fine. What is it? Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah! What did you just... Oh! You and your awful boyfriend set me up again. I'm so done with this. You've made me miserable for so long. Oh, come on. I think it's an improvement. You're just so mean. I can't take it anymore. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wow, that hole is deep. Do you think she died? Never mind, I don't care. You should come down from there. We killed her! That was so great. You've made me so happy today. I want you to take this flower. It's pretty like me. This way you'll always have a little piece of me with you. Oh dear! Has anyone seen Lily? I don't see her anywhere. Nugget saw where the girl went. Nugget knows. Shut up, Nugget. You didn't see anything. Nugget, I swear to whatever God, your messed up family believes in. If Lily fell down that hole, I, you dog, I'm pushing you in after her. Nugget will not let give the teacher satisfaction. Teacher will never take Nugget alive. Oh, God, he's fucking dead now as well. Oh, no. Well, that hole is deep. I can't even see the bottom. We're going to have to get the janitor out here with the ladder and get them out. Oh, Mr. Janitor. I'm coming, I'm coming. That seems to be the problem there, Miss Jiggly Tits. <laughs> he said what we're all thinking. Oh, I'm 
so freaking adorable and cute. Look at me go. Look at my little swagger. 